Hello and welcome to this very short lecture where we are going to answer the question what is compute in AWS? Before we begin to explore compute services, resources and features, we must first understand what is meant by the term compute. So what is it? Put simply, compute resources can be considered the brains and processing power required by applications and systems to carry out computational tasks via a series of instructions. So essentially compute is closely related to common server components which many of you will already be familiar with such as CPUs and RAM. With that in mind a physical server within a data center would be considered a compute resource as it may have multiple CPUs and many gigs of RAM to process instructions given by the operating system and applications. Within AWS there are a number of different services and features that offer compute power to provide different functions. Some of these services provide compute which can comprise of utilizing hundreds of EC2 instances or virtual servers which may be used continuously for months or even years processing millions upon millions of instructions. On the other end of this scale you may only utilize a few hundred milliseconds of compute resource to execute just a few lines of code within AWS Lambda before relinquishing that compute power. AWS Lambda is a serverless compute resource in AWS and I'll cover more on this service later in this course. Compute resources can be consumed in different quantities for different lengths of time across a range of categories offering a wide scope of performance and benefit options. So it will really depend on your requirements as to which compute resource you use within AWS and this course will discuss them all allowing you to decide which is best for your implementation. As a quick high level reference AWS offers a cloud compute index which can be found using the link on screen. And this shows different examples and scenarios of where you might use different compute deployment units. That brings me to the end of this very short lecture. Now we are aware of what compute is, let's start by looking at some of the services offered by AWS that provide this compute resource, starting with Elastic Cloud Compute, EC2. 